video we're here in tokyo i am so excited we arrived this morning very early around like 3 30 a.m so we walked around town all day to kind of just kill the time before we're able to check in i am so excited to be here we're gonna do a little birthday trip for max and jason and then our friend chow is here as well and then this week we're also meeting some other friends in tokyo so we're here just with a little squad i'm kind of on a little boys trip but it will be so much fun. I always feel so inspired when I am in Japan and around the fall is literally the best moment to go. I'm gonna take a little nap. I am so tired, you can see. And I will take you guys with in upcoming days. Okay guys, I just got ready for dinner. I'm wearing this really cute top from Orson Iris. I think that's how I pronounce it. Um, a brand from New York. These pants are from Frankie Shop and then this is from Kain. Okay, funniest story ever. I, not too long ago in LA, I went shopping. I walked into the changing room and I literally <laughs> had this shirt like down underneath my boobs and I was already shopping for like 20 minutes. I didn't even notice it. Other people didn't even say anything, but my nipples were fully out in this shirt. Okay, I'm kind of late. I'm gonna go meet Jason downstairs. Max is already on the way. And then we're gonna go eat some sushi tonight. I'm very excited. The last time I went to like a really fancy place for sushi, I actually like didn't even enjoy it so much and then we went to a casual one and it was like so good so i feel you just like never really know i mean maybe that's also just <laughs> my western palette okay we're gonna put some shoes on and then we're gonna go eat Hi, Nathan. you don't look like you're fighting jet lag Makeup's thank on god point. for makeup camera is not on the point. fact what that <laughs> happened to this thing yeah i can't even show you guys but my camera fell on the ground and it's completely cracked i don't want to bring it in to repair because then i have nothing to vlog with so i'm just doing everything with the broken camera right now they're ready for us they're ready for us yeah they're ready for us everyone is fighting chat like to the fullest we can literally barely open up our eyes here like that big stool is for you, okay? The biggest guy. To our very first dinner. Oh, I like the little nets. Oh, it's good. It's good. Now we know shrimp. Sometimes yes, sometimes no. Good. <laughs> We're in the hotel right now and we're waiting for Max, Jason and Chow. We're gonna just explore Tokyo today. I'm gonna take you guys away. It's actually my third time here. The first time I only was here for two days with Max. Last year I was here for a couple days. This year we're actually gonna celebrate Halloween together, which is gonna be really fun. We're gonna get out, we're gonna go to a party tonight and I'm really excited. So let's go. Excited for a little Pikachu. 
Pikachu knife and knife. Oh my god. Okay, I didn't tell you guys, but I have been wanting to be a Pikachu for years for Halloween. But every year when it comes to it, I'm like, all the girls are kind of like slutty and cute and like whatever. And I'm like, this is my only time to like also get a cute outfit. Also, a lot of Halloweens I was single, so I was like, ah, I don't know, but Pikachu. <laughs> this is the way to go. So now we're married and settled, so we're gonna go all. <laughs> now we're gonna be a Pikachu. Okay, we finished lunch. Honestly, this was probably one of the best restaurants we have been to. Obviously, I absolutely love like clean food and eating and stuff. And it was exactly the type of cuisine that I would make at home or that Max mother would make. It was so good. Okay, we're gonna go do a little bit of shopping because I thought it was gonna be much warmer in Japan to be honest. And I definitely need some like new fall pieces. Maybe get like some nice sweaters or something because I am always freezing. <laughs> Have a look here i'm gonna get this big oversized jacket and you can zip it up and then a top and then a leather dress and then these shoes with it so very cute amazing okay. heavy i guess this is the benefit of shopping with the boys they can help me carry <laughs> okay i just got back from shopping i got some cute stuff at emmy that you could see and then we went downstairs to like the beauty department i absolutely love going to the beauty department in japan because i feel they have so many local like gut brands i also went to cosmic kitchen it's all clean beauty which obviously i absolutely love because i care what i put in my body and on my body I got this palette from a beauty brand called Shelvo, I think it is. I kind of forgot my blush here, so I got a new palette. I think this is from their like holiday collection. I've been really into a blush phase and I really like the sticky one because I feel it always blends much better into your skin rather than a powder, but you can kind of see a powder. And then I also like this darker color because I often like to add a little blush on my eyelids, but I love it. And what else did I got? Oh yeah, I brought a couple things from this beauty brand F Organics. I got a moisture foaming face wash. I needed this because the face wash I normally use, it exploded in my bag on the way here. So when I opened my bag, this face wash was just everywhere in my toiletry. So I needed a new face wash and I got in. And then I also got a new concealer. Is this the same brand? No, this is called Advos. I didn't realize when I arrived here that my concealer was finished, but it is really hard to find a concealer in Japan because I asked her, I was like, do you have multiple colors? And she was like, no, we only have three colors. She was like, I don't know, we have yours. So I found this one where you can kind of like mix and match so I could make it a little darker or a little lighter. So I hope this is gonna be like 
my color because I don't know. We shall see. I'm excited to try all these out. I'm gonna get ready and then we're gonna meet Ika and Marco and we're gonna go out tonight. I think that will be really fun partying in Japan. It's the only place where Max will like ever have a drink because he normally doesn't drink. He kind of gets allergic uh, from alcohol. It's like super red, but um, in Japan, sometimes he will drink, so we shall see. I just got ready. I just put a little sweater on and then I have this amazing jacket that I got from Cos. It's actually new and I've been wearing it so much. I am obsessed with it. And then these earrings, I got them in a revolve from this brand. I'm not really sure. I'm going to link it down below. I know where to find it, but I don't know what it is. So we'll put that down there. And then Kate jeans and Kate belt as well. And I think this bag is from like by far or something. Quick and easy. I think we're going to eat some sushi again tonight. It's actually funny. Last time on my trip to Japan, I barely ate sushi. But I guess this time we're kind of in a sushi vibe. I think Max picked a restaurant. So let's go. Hey. Hi. Hi. Oh, hi. Hello. Guys, we are currently changing into our Halloween outfit. Ika just got here. <laughs> we got Ika to shoot for everyone. Wait, turn around. Oh my god. Ah! This is amazing. This is literally the best. Guys, the days of sexy little outfits where you're uncomfortable and cold are over. We don't need more. We do not need that. This is literally a bitch. There is no shape in these things. <laughs> it hangs like a rod here. It's so comfy though. Sorry. <laughs> so cute. We're Halloween ready. There he goes. <laughs> no, it doesn't work with a wiggle. <laughs> It's fun. almost 4 p.m. Oh my god, where shall I start from last night? Um, what a freaking night. We all went out with our Pikachu shoots and did like a Halloween party with our friend Marco DJing and it was literally so much fun. It was so fun to just run around Tokyo in our suits and like dance and like, I don't know, I guess like just have a little bit of playtime. You know, back in LA, I just feel we sometimes have like very serious lives in a way, you know, like very... Very adult. Very adult. <laughs> I just feel like I'm so disciplined and structured and whatever. So it's like really nice to do sometimes have a little bit of play and no better place to do that in Tokyo. So that was a lot of fun. My throat is definitely struggling. We woke up at noon today, had some breakfast and I just got ready. Wait, we're both going to be dressed up for the first time together. Wow. Look, right? I love this outfit. Why are you always so cute? I love that. Hold on, my battery is almost done. Okay, we're on the way to the meetup. I'm not gonna lie, I'm always a little bit, a little like nervous before going to the meetup. Good nurse though, good nurse. And what are we doing tonight? We are going to okay. one of my. E this is your, this is Honestly, that's all we do in Japan. We are in Tokyo, especially. We just walk, eat, 
Rafe, repeat. Eat, sleep, rave, repeat. Eat, sleep, rave, repeat. Everyone say hi to Sana's YouTube. Hi. <laughs> say hi. Hi. We're here at the meetup. Say hi to YouTube. <laughs> Look how many amazing girls shows up. We're gonna go for a little walk today, but it'll yeah. be fun. Let's go. Hi, Jason. Hi. <laughs> here with every meetup. Just another casual day. <laughs> Sana. ice cream cheesecake. 
it tastes mint somewhere. A lot going on. But it which is going to be really fun. Yesterday's meetup was amazing. It was amazing to meet so many of you. I actually was reading a letter I got from one of you guys. It, I don't know, it just always gives me so much more motivation and it really fulfills me to read your stories. It's very much a special place in my heart. But um, yeah, the meetup was really fun and then we had an incredible dinner at Tipanyaki Akasa. I think that's what it's called. If you are ever in Tokyo and you really want to do a treat meal, like it's <laughs> pretty expensive, then I would definitely recommend that place because if you've been there before, it is absolutely amazing. I'm excited for the rest of the trip, honestly. I feel I've been really good this trip and just being so present and like really having fun and all of that. And the team back in LA is handling a lot of my things and it's just a really, a really good feeling. So I hope you enjoyed today's video. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. I think in Kyoto I'm gonna film a little coffee talk next. So if you have any questions or any topics for the coffee talk you want me to touch base on then let me know in the comments down below. I love you guys and I see you very soon.